Superman holds the weight of the Earth on his shoulders. You're sure you want to do this, farm boy? I think so. I mean, yeah, yes. Brace yourself. The heavens ain't a trifle. So, what do I need to know, Atlas? When Zeus punished me to shoulder my burden, I accepted it as uh, a combatant who fought nobly in war, but lost. <clears throat> no, I mean, how much does it weigh? Mm, the most you can bear, mm, plus more. Do we like do a handoff? Take it not with your hands. Take it with your heart. <laughs> the weight! Impossible! How, how long will you be gone, Atlas? Atlas? As the sun rose, Metropolis began to wake. And a helicopter flies over Metropolis. Inside is Jimmy Olsen and Lois Lane reporting the news. Lois Lane is worried because Superman has not been seen. Jimmy Olsen reassures her that everything will be handled safely. They report the news as the day goes on. Superman holds the world on his shoulders. <sighs> <clears throat> At 8 a.m., a poor defenseless cat is stuck in a tree. Oh, what will happen? Oh, who will save the cat? Meow. It's okay. I won't hurt you. I got gotcha. you. All safe. Meow. <clears throat> <clears throat> I was worried my Mr. Mittens would never get out. No problem, ma'am. Just doing what Superman would. <sighs> Superman continues to hold the world on his shoulders. As he endures the pain of everything plus more, he can also feel the presence of everyone in Metropolis. And everyone is doing what they can to protect it. 11.30 a.m. Oh no! It is a supervillain! Been waiting to collect on the contract to torch this joint. With Superman off sipping my ties, there's nobody who can stop me! <laughs> but look! Up there in the sky! It's not Superman, but... Supergirl! She quickly handles the foes, and... With a cheery smile, she says, If it weren't for my super cousin, I might not be a hero. Plus, he helps me out, so why not help him? I'd never miss the chance to help him back. <sighs> Superman continues to hold the world on his shoulders. It's 2 p.m., and oh no, the Metropolis Museum is being attacked by Silver Banshee. Who will help? And look, there she is, Black Canary, with a hoof, ah, boom, bam! With a swift strike, she takes down Silver Banshee. With a clean smile and a cool walk away, anything for Superman's town, he's the original. <sighs> Superman continues to hold the world on his shoulders. 5 p.m. Oh no! It's the chemical plant! And who dares to attack? It's Chemo! He's going after the hazmat tanks! But look, up there in the sky, it's Firestorm! He makes quick work of the chemical compound green giant Chemo and flies off with a... No problem. Tell Superman I said thanks for everything! <sighs> How are you holding up, farm boy? Like putting up <laughs> hay. Keeping everything from crashing down, it means sacrificing much. If not for you, I'd have sacrificed a day no father should miss. My daughter Calypso was radiant at her wedding. 
I don't need an oracle to know she'll have joy for the rest of her days. <laughs> and Zeus, <laughs> certain no one would ever volunteer to spell me. His face when he saw me escort her at the ceremony. <laughs> You've given me a day of memories I'll cherish for eternity. Now, I accept my burden again. Ah. <laughs> Were you worried I wouldn't come back? Might have crossed my mind. <sighs> Perhaps only you understand as I do. Those charged with the weight of the world would never wish it on another. Though it's good <clears throat> to know others will help when you need it. Don't you agree? <sighs> I'm just going to rest here a while. <laughs> good job, Farmboy.